guys welcome back for another video it's favorites it's january favorites and you like like girl pray tell tell me why you in that car well i'm in z car for two reasons hello i gotta pick up my son i'm a glam mom i'm a mom on the go so this is dedicated to all y'all y'all women on the go if you don't have time you can still take your beauty with you so in this video i'm going to show you guys what i take with me on the go and still get it done because yes this is a full face of in the car yes um i didn't do a video on you know applying it in the car comment down below if y'all want me to do that but i also have a giveaway so wait until the end of the video to know the details or maybe i'll put it in the beginning but it, without further ado let's get into the video we are going to go through my favorites because I have some and I have some fails, but everything is in this car. That's why we are doing car style. So I'm going to show you my favorites. It's all in here and I got to show you my hair, hair favorites. It's a random. Got to show you some fails too. Yeah. Okay. Favorites. We are going to start off with the hair product, which is not here, but I'm going to show you. And I talked about this in another video and it is the cocoa cream curling cream from Darcy Botanicals okay Darcy is sold out of this product but I gave an alternative for any of those for any of you guys that wanted to know it is glycerin free so I really really love this but it is very 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 similar to the S. Beauty um, Coral Friend smoothie one of my all-time favorites like leave-in conditioners it's super moisturizing it's amazing for this time of year if your hair is dry if it's high porosity it can be low porosity it can be any porosity but if you have dry hair that is a great thick and creamy you get moisture for days that's all i'm saying but i'll show a picture my girlfriend smoothie is kind of <laughs> shot <clears throat> but it does come in a jar it's no longer in a bottle but it's amazing okay so that is my all-time favorite um if i can think of something else i'll leave it down below but that's the main hair product that i have been loving um, okay guys two favorites i totally forgot about my black fades by key desi perkins collaboration yes and my ge slap caps love them um i'll leave a link down below Sometimes, well, in the beginning of the year, they had like a BOGO sale. So I got a black and a gray. And I also got a, like a walnut. It's it's like a beige color. Matches with you with that. And a purple. Favorites. In terms of eye cream, Sarah Miracle. It's in my skincare routine from my work day at home. I'll link, leave that link. But the Sarah Miracle Eye Illuminating Cream is amazing. But I've also been loving this. And this is the... This is from a brand on um, Amazon called Dewey Sale, and this is their Eye Plus Cream. Amazing. This is so good. You get 30 milli milliliters. I believe that's an ounce. You usually get like less than that. You get a third of that in most eye creams, but this is so good. The texture is like a gel, so it's great for during the day, but it's very, very, very hydrating. I love this because I get uh puffy puffiness under the eyes i tend to get puffiness under the eyes so this is ideal for me and i absolutely love it okay another item i'm gonna try to keep this to like under 10 but we're gonna try okay um and i'm gonna talk about ones that y'all haven't heard me talk about before hopefully and stuff that i feel back in love with because y'all know i'm on no buy i'm doing well I got through January, but anyway, this is the NARS Laguna. Now, this is from their holiday collection. They, this was a blush palette with a bronzer in it. So this is the virtual domination. It is old, y'all, but I am panning this. And on my second channel, if you didn't know, Missy Q Memoirs, I am documenting my whole no buy, low buy year. And also sharing with you guys some like some deep stuff about the no buy. But anyway, this is um, NARS Laguna. I love this. I fell back in love with it. It is great for contouring my nose, but it's a great bronzer. I have it on today. It looks like it would not be deep enough for, you know, tan skin, but love this okay and i am also panning this which i have fell in love with and this is final cut 
So I am excited about panning this. These two I mixed together and I really like this blue base as well. So I've been loving this palette. Okay, another product that I have been loving, loving, and I'm going to put some on right now. This is from Visanti. This is the Matte Crush Lipstick Pencil and It's Your Mauve. This is a dupe to my Tom Ford Indian Rose and it's a fraction of the cost. I do have my unboxing of my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. I'm, y'all, Ipsy Glam Bag Plus is coming for BoxyCharm's neck. I unsubscribed. Um, I'm just giving myself a year and seeing which one is better. And I'm telling you, this one is better. Look at that. Isn't that a beautiful, like, mauve pink? Perfect, right? And it's a comfortable matte. Love these. Reminds me a lot of the NARS, but you're a fraction of a cost, y'all. Anyway, I'll leave a link down below. Another item from my Ipsy Glam Bag. Let's just talk about that because this is from my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. So all of these are going to be full size. I love the whole bag. Okay? Check out the unboxing. But this is the Murad Multivitamin Infusion Oil. I think this was like, was this $74? This is an amazing oil. I use this in the morning. It smells like a spa. If you want to have a spa day at home, this is a type of oil. Yes, it's like that herbal like spa but it has vitamin a through f so you're gonna get your vitamin c so it's a great oil it's a great like uh serum booster in the morning you can mix it with your foundation if you're dry i put that on first then i use this other serum that was also in my ipsy glam bag and the lid is off but this is the hey honey good morning honey silk facial serum now this is a serum slash primer that's the thing i love about it you can use it by itself or you can put it under your makeup i love this it's like that like milky texture it's like a milky like oh it's so good and it's very very hydrating perfect you know honey is a humectant it you know it um it has moisture it attracts moisture from the environment so that's what makes it such a great one but Oh, sorry this is the lid you get one ounce and I love this it has amino acids sea buckthorn oil and vitamin E everything that I put on my face need to have a benefit these days because the girl is turning shorty 40 this year <laughs> so everything has to have a purpose you know what I'm saying okay love this before love it again this is the Ofra highlighter in Rodeo Drive. I love this. Now the packaging is pretty bulky, but um, I love that it does have a mirror and I still haven't put peeled off this film, but oh, there you go. I like it. I love it. It's so soft. It melts into the skin. Ofra does highlighters very well and liquid lipsticks. I'm just saying. Okay. I think this might be the final. No. Oh man. I left it at home. Dead Sexy by Tokyo Milk. Amazing, amazing scent. It's only like $30 or $35, something like that, which is super cheap for a one ounce bottle of like fragrance. Smells so good. I am a Tokyo Milk fan. So I like Let's Eat Cake and I like, uh, what is it? Tainted Love. Oh, so good. Just some recommendations, y'all. If y'all like that sophisticated, and I like that it's sophisticated scents, but, you know, some of them are sweet. Some of them, you know, look at the notes. But this one is like a warm vanilla with jazz. I, does it have jasmine in it? It has, I think, pepper or something like that. But it's like very, it smells so good. Anyway, probably not like something that you smell too. So it doesn't remind me of anything that I have. And I loved it, Sexy, for that reason. Okay, HG. This is the fun size of the Violet Voss palette. I love it. I have it on today. Love the fact that you can do cool and warm tones. This is a baby mini of the Modern Renaissance palette, I feel like, but on another level. I love this shade. I don't, it doesn't have a name, but this shade right here and these two shades, I feel like Chocolate Girls to my porcelain sisters can actually benefit for that from this it has a mirror it's very nice packaging i love it because you can wipe it off such a great palette for on the go it's small enough it's compact great for travel thank you violet boss thank you ipsy glam bag yes okay 
I'm trying to talk about stuff that you haven't heard me talk about. Um, this one I gotta talk about Glossier Stretch Concealer. I have it in medium, y'all. This concealer now, this is a concealer that I will not use on its own, but I am trying to get through this and the Tarte Shape Tape. This is so amazing to put under any type of drying type of concealer. If you feel dry, this one, put this one on first because this is very, very emollient and hydrating. This is a, it's a hydrating concealer, I feel like. And it gives such a dewy glow. So I even put it all the way up on my cheekbone because I get that glossy, like fresh. Whenever y'all see that, I'm probably wearing this. So this again is in medium. I want to get in the darker shade just because I feel like it would be a color corrector for me. But um, this is definitely a product that I changed my mind about because I did not like this. It's a beautiful, flawless finish. I really like this Glossier Stretch Concealer. This Thrive, Thrive Cosmetics. This is their Brilliant Eye Brightener in Stella. Y'all, this doesn't stay on. It's beautiful in the corner, but... It does not stay on at all does not stay on at all it's so disappointing because it's such a beautiful shade and it blends out I probably could use it as a cheek but it's supposed to be for like your inner corner and when I say like this is super if somebody is fair fairer than I am you probably would love it but I still feel like it fades it costs too much to fade okay so this right here is a disappointment to regret something i regret buying and it is a fail for the month oh lord amazing cosmetics illuminate eye primer i used this and i was like why did i do it it just messed up everything and your under eye is so important to i feel like the whole outcome of your makeup if you put something under your eye and just messes up and it crepes and everything, it just messes up the whole look because your under eye is just like everything. I feel like you can kind of fix everything else, but when it comes to that under eye, y'all, mm-mm, mm-mm. This was no me bueno para me. I tried this, the Born This Way. Naturally Radiant. Now, it's a regret and a favorite. <laughs> this is the first time I, I hate this under my eyes, but I like this on my face it is such a nice like finish so it was a regret under my eyes but it is a love on my face that's so f and it's because of the consistency it has nothing to do with the shade now the shade does match my skin tone um i thought that this is something that i could maybe kind of color correct with or spot conceal i'm not going to do that with this this is something that's just great for uh, on my face so those are my favorites in terms of what i'm reading this month I am reading Samantha March's Christie. I'm so excited about that. That book is good. Uh, that book is good. I'll let you guys know on my second channel what I think about it. The other thing is, another favorite is I got a new camera. Yes, I'm not using a new camera. I'm, I'm vlogging from my phone right now. But... I just picked up the Canon 77D so and a studio so I'm really excited oh I'm gonna be bringing you know I wanted to make sure you know I, I love my content and I want to upgrade and go you know I want to level up this year I gotta level up and I gotta live it up level up live it up okay that is the motto I hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up Please subscribe and I'll see you in the next so video. So if you made it to the end of this video, thanks so much for watching. And comment down below and let me know what beauty product you changed your mind about. I would love to know. Leave your comments and I'll see you in the comments. And also don't forget to enter the giveaway. Everything is in the description box. Must be in the US. Love you guys so much. And don't forget to check out my other videos. Thanks guys. Bye.